Hello and welcome to Guide My Work. We wanted to take a few minutes and show you just how easy it is to get started using this software. Once you've signed up online at GuideMyWork.com, all it takes is a few simple steps to have a workstation up and running. We've designed Guide My Work to be as easy as possible to set up, so you can spend less time on complex configurations and more time actually producing parts. After you've logged into the Guide My Work site, you'll notice a menu on the left-hand side of your screen. This is where you'll go to set up your plant locations, work cells, stations, parts, and station instructions. Each setup menu is designed to be user-friendly with minimal steps and help functions along the way, just like this. You'll want to follow the order on the menu when you first start, but you can go back and add, edit, delete, or change options at any point. Once you've gone through the setup and have a station ready to go, you're ready to download Guide My Work. All you need is a web-enabled device and a strong internet connection. Guide My Work can be used on a PC, tablet, or handheld device. Simply go to the Station Setup menu on the device that you're going to use and select the Download Station Setup File option at the top of the page. Run the installation and Guide My Work will be ready to go. Once the Guide My Work browser appears on the screen, you'll need to enter a station access code. Keep in mind, each station can only be assigned to one device. Once it's assigned, it cannot be loaded to another device. On the administrative site in the Station Setup screen, find the station you wish to register and select the Generate Access Code button. An access code will then appear. Copy the code, then paste it into the browser. Once you select register station, that's it. Now you've got an MES station right at your fingertips. So what are you waiting for? Get going on Guide My Work today. And be sure to check out our additional training videos to learn more about each setup menu, reporting functionality, and administrative features.